It was really good, actually. Yeah, he was definitely holding it together. Two of the games were last hit, but it was still a 3 0. For sure. I know that the joke between these players is that every single time they play, the other person wins. <laughs> it's basically like MSV, I think, lost to Big. It's like, I'm going to get you next time, but he ended up doing so. It's very, <laughs> very back and forth. I'm sure the set count is even, or maybe well, Slayton won his yeah, favorite. Close enough. Yeah. I can definitely see this going either way. MSV has that little, maybe the TO fatigue, which is a very reasonable. Yeah, it's a real thing. Yeah, I know MSV has to talk about that a lot. It's, it's a very, very real thing. Someone who uh, has ran my fair share alongside. It's it's rough, man. <laughs> At some really point, you just there. you just really get tired. But MSP fights through it. He's and uh, wow, and Bagel needs to uh, Bagel needs to figure out what he's doing, right? I mean, he's, he's lost that stock. It wasn't like terribly early, but not a pressure you lose when you get that first stock loss. Is endless is rough. Or you just kind of. Play safe, play defensive on you. Not really much you can do to it. <laughs> okay, that was cute. But yeah, exactly this. You just rack up so much damage on Edelus if you have the lead. Yeah, the edge guard is very, very good for fragging against Edelus. So, low turret. I know Edelus will do a lot of like high pillar to force him to go high. I think it's really hard to break that pillar. Mm -hmm. And then just like just ferry him when he comes up. It's very, very low turret. And then he's the player to just lab those out and just have the second nature. In fact, <laughs> That was such a good recovery, and Bagel punched him in the face for it. <laughs> you love to see it. He's got a way, and then he just pops up once, and you just, you just punch him, and he's it. That's a trick, though. Sometimes um, the circus act is really fun, but you can't let the clown distract you with the uh, the, the big honky red nose or the squirty flower. You gotta know when to sock him in the face, you know? <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Get that clown out of here. <laughs> Everyone knows Bagel hates up. clowns, so you know, he's gotta... Yeah, I mean, he's got the little, little clown-looking skin, all the little face colors. <laughs> yeah, not wrong! When he, especially when he has, like, the armored up. Oh, uh, yeah, you certainly know. I love the little ice on this stage, like, the red, blue, yellow, It looks really green. cool. Ooh, okay. Bagel's starting to fish a little bit. Like, I know he wants to bring this back, and he can just get some armor up and just close it out. Shoot some shards at him. Dacus? Dacus. Man, I gotta give these guys some credit. Pulling out of this Dacus every time except the one time it kills. Which I guess is just how it goes versus Atlas. Ooh, this is really big. Yeah, the fact that he was able to keep that down. combo going was crazy, by the way. Like, the crowd got so far away and he was able to still chase him down. <laughs> he's rock tricks, trying to bait out some parry and bagel with his force of shards on him. He's not getting having too much icicle parries recently. And that's like a big part of this match, is shutting out Edelus' aggressive offense. Absolutely. Ooh. Breaking out the shards are so good against Edelus, just like in the end of the This like has been a tense game one, man. It's definitely a preview of what we're looking for in this set. So <laughs> Both threatening for it at the same time. It's like the best thing ever. This is really, truly the, the rivals of Aether arms race, right? You have both people on both sides threatening a forward air. Really good to extend the hitbox on that. He threw the rock up so it would land, so you can have a little bit more active frames on that. And then just in case he went super high, it's the super rock charge would send it. It's super duper smart. MSB is the smartest player I know. Him and Proto are like the, the biggest brain people. It can be a downside if you run out of mental stack later on, but he's keeping in the tank, doing TO work, keeping his brain active when he's playing. He definitely has a collective IQ of at least three crag yeah. which doesn't sound like a lot, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. Starting on Gates, too. <clears throat> I know that's a, a solid stage for both well, characters, but... Yeah, it's still really strange to see. You know, to Rockwell again, I know this is a stage that MSB <laughs> absolutely loves. The fair crack change house. on the side. This is the where crack. MSB will always just say, you're in Crack House now. Like character to crack. advantage. A lot of mains love their stages. Absolutely like Tempest. I know Forest Burn's okay on Blazing. Which one might be like one of the only. <laughs> Frozen, ones. yeah, it was the one I was gonna What's think of. Edelus is not a big fan of that stage. I think that's the only one that's like a huge, huge outlier. Yeah, I mean, uh, Treetop allows Maple to get dunks earlier, so I'm not. Yeah, that's a good stage for Maple. 
Okay, you never want to tech in on that. <clears throat> Do not ever tech in on that unless you're basically to die off the side. You easily just get like F smashed or maybe even frozen if you tech in. It's true. I think it's a very, very popular little setup. The trick to that is usually to you no know, DI it, I mean no tech it, and just kinda like hold in so you bounce off and like barely go off stage. Or maybe tech out because they might still dack it. It's still a big risk though. It's so scary, man. The truth of the matter is it really isn't a a be all end all option, but you just gotta make sure you're not picking the trigger expected, right? It's very situation based, it's a big risk. Mm -hmm. Whoa, wow, they were definitely back to back there when that fair came out. Vega was going for a lot of these really mm. aggressive down beats, and this one just okay. catches the tech, doesn't nair because that's his fastest frame option, <laughs> and then they get the fourth hit and just pops up for a fair. Bagel fair, fair, can't drift fair. out because it's rock ball, and he just dies off the side of the fair. Ooh, huge lead this fair. game. Wow. Like, this is a very, very good track stage, and I can see MSB absolutely loving this pick, but it's really working out for him. I feel like he has a huge lead, but he's been doing really, really well. Okay. <clears throat> Bagel kind of cleaning it up right now. Uh, full stock lead. Really, really Sorry. good fair armor there. If you get back on stage, that's time to parry. Fair armor is so, so good for that list. But you're in Crag House. He didn't commit to a second. I think he needed like a, a flat boost off of that, so he didn't have a second. Yeah, jump. I think he double jumped into that fair. Maybe that, just hoping yeah. he would that or something. <laughs> yeah. That slide awesome. into it was insane, by the way. <laughs> Like a Kara Strong, whatever they're called back in the Smash days, where you do a turnaround and charge it as you slide through. Super cool. It's something I see with like Brawl Snake. Yeah, exactly, exactly that. Uh, Link. Yeah, I could see that. I think that was a little misinput, maybe one like an icicle or like. I could see it. Up. Oh, that misinput might actually cost him this oh game. My oh my god! Oh, that was super clean. MSB's implementing so much stuff with Rock Shine recently. <laughs> oh my Wait, god, the shard saved him. I was gonna say that is the funniest thing ever. The Rock killed him, and then the Rock gave it and taketh away. It, it <laughs> gave him back his life. Oh, okay. Very clean. I'll be honest, bagel. if I was bageled, I lost that set because of the Rock. Be I might be himself. out of the set. Yeah, I, I might be out for the tournament. Just, all right, good stuff, man. Yeah, he just fist bumps him. It's a 2-0. <laughs> he just mentally checks out. Definitely, like, the biggest what thing. What a good game. About being crazy. one of these players on these stages, just keeping that composure and being mm -hmm. able to recover from things like that. Even if he lost that, a true champion mentality makes it's these so tough players. It's funny, too, because I see it, right? I see this rock, and I think to myself, like, okay, well, you know, they've done a lot of changes to, to the way Rock Shard works so that you won't, uh, you won't accidentally save your opponent with it. Uh, no, they've done a lot of changes to Crag. <laughs> they've adjusted Crag's lockout, not, not the Rock Shards. You will save your opponent with them if you're not the Crag. Rock Shard limitations, Ah, Papa John's gonna love them. Ooh, we're going right back off. Exactly. Shaky does. Imagine that was jump cancelable. I know the crack man would love that. <laughs> jump cancelable rock shine, MSB and Julie would have a field day. Do you imagine just seeing rock shine on the loop just <laughs> <laughs> it becomes optimal part of like his B and B's. You know what surprised me? It's called it, Rock Shine is the 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 accepted term, right? It's it's actually not even that fast of a move. Weirdly, like, like, it sounds crazy to hear that from me, but it's not even, like, that fast. It's not shine, is what I'm saying. It's not, like, crazy fast. It's still pretty quick, though. Yeah, it's decently fast. I must be getting some versions off of it recently. Oh, like, he's been Rock using it a lot. He used to use a lot of the turnaround option, so he knew, like, back here, Rock Shine turnaround fair in the air as, like, a way to get it around. Like, Forest Burn down me. Like, just the empty, the empty <laughs> inhale. Yep. Cake loves doing that. He'll get, like, a... A down tilt, in, jump, inhale, reverse bear. And must be doing the same kind of thing with uh, bear using rock shine, reverse bear. Kind of like that little pop up. Yeah, it's, it's like a. It's nice that it has a little hitbox too, right? Yeah. So you get to turn around with a hitbox. <laughs> <laughs> that was so <laughs> not true. That has no hits on it. God, I love it. <laughs> worked out anyway. But hey, Bagel saying, hey, you can't just make a fool out of me, alright? Gonna knock you back off stage. We're gonna try this again. <laughs> Still got it in the thing. Ooh, that was risky. <laughs> this is air dodge. Well, I don't really think I was gonna realize that. Spike. I think he would have been a lot more aggressive if he realized Bagel burnt his air dodge there. He probably would have done a couple fairs and then Edelus offsays on air dodge. Gigantic life. It's, it's like Maple without a jump because then you don't have up B. I mean, you don't have up air. You're just 
definitely dead in the list. You can be spiked so easy. You're such a big, like, target painted on you. You look like Paige. You can see the colors on him. <laughs> <laughs> Water colors. Oh, 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 there. That Stop was it. crazy. <laughs> I think the craze have to be just down me there just to like set him up with not him. Wrong. Like not off wrong. the top. Bagel's done that a couple times before where he'll like down me like as a kill off and just like. I think if they were both on last stop, I could see it. Yeah, like a big scramble thing. Man, that bear has been in that. I don't like that, for a while. that was really risky because MSP yeah. didn't jump. He's patient. All collected those. Dang, we are 2 1 right now. That's awesome. This could be a game five, honestly. It just depends on the counter picks. He says always go back and forth with these two. Oh, yeah. Game 5 would not be a surprise at all. He's banned. I saw Blazing. I see Jules Veil. And I see <laughs> four. <coughs> I, I can see that actually. Good. Yeah. Blazing um, is like the bagel stage. I know he loves that. And Jules and Force Boy I see too. Force Boy makes complete sense. Blazing yeah. makes the most sense out of the three. And Jules Vale, you just don't want to give the Edelus an FD with a platform to edge cancel off of. Yeah. I know Edelus Vale is a big Blazing fan. Oh, just yes. Just because it's like a second platform that you can use that you can move on to. And uh, I, apparently, I know some people have been iffy on it in the past, and I'm talking far in the past. But the ability for, I think the, the problem was people said you couldn't spread ice easily. But that just simply isn't true. f tilt is fantastic for it. Up, to up B is really good you can for it. Up B, jump, and then icicles are very safe because if your opponent's staying grounded, icicles are going to hit the platform and spread ice there too. So, like, yeah, no, um, <clears throat> that's the biggest complaint I've ever heard on our stage was that it's hard to spread, set up ice. Yeah, and nowadays, know. that's not even something people consider. <laughs> like, it, it's just so a non issue. This counter pick's working pretty good for. I would agree. This is a bagel pick, yeah. He banned the pseudo FD so that yeah. bagel would take him to real FD. That makes sense. <laughs> and that's what I said before. This is, in my eyes, Crag House. This is the secret good Crag stage. Um, despite everything telling me that this should be a very bad Crag stage. Yeah, he is. Yeah, hard time pulling rock. People down people play it so well. And I, I don't know what it is. Like, that's. Don't die, maybe that's it. That, that up B there was super good. I don't think it was intention to stuff out like an aggressive option. But I know he kind of gets a little bit of mileage out of these like high pillars. They're very risky, but when they do work, they're actually pretty really good. For sure. Oh, yeah. The point blank down B was a little risky there. Maybe getting it a ton of damage off of that. Oh, Almost that's even really the game nice. And getting MSP off stage. I mean, if Edelus kept his armor, I'd say he was in the lead. <laughs> like, Basically, yeah. He's got like three stocks on him. Oh, this is real scary, though. Recovering his Edelus. You know, you got Fair the punch armor, can't take that. You got the trading hit. You got the glancing blow. We'll take it. 12% off. Couple Enough things. percent that you can, you can probably find the stocks soon. I know one Edelus thing that uh, to catch people edge guarding is Jab 3. It's so big. It's massive. Catch people come up. Like, I know it's a rich edge guard if Craig has no pillar, where you can just hold Jab 3 at the ledge <laughs> and you can just do that. Oh my god, that little turnaround on the... He broke the pillar and then he turned around up there again. And we see a little lead. Bagel is up now. I think all Bagel has to do is just not overextend too hard. He just kind of just plays his cards right. He's got this game in the bag. That's going to be brutal from both sides here, huh? He's just playing a patient. He's not going off too deep. Respecting him to be space. Respecting the rocks, too. <clears throat> Ooh, I saw the down strong start, Bagel. And he's not gonna die. Like if he gets knocked up in the air by something, he'll live. At least that. Hit. <laughs> Ooh, okay, now we're at the spot where a conversion will kill. It's a little scrambly. Let's see how these players handle it. Okay, taking it super safe. One neutral backed off. That now he wants armor. Super good to prevent him from armoring. That there's rock shards there. Oh, oh. the rock shards! They oh came back with a vengeance. Two games. Two games, man. Double pop off. Bagel not happy about that sub purple. And if we take that, clutching it out. If I'm MSB, I'm going to bed, cuddling my big rock plush. You know, it has done nothing but let. It has done nothing but save him. Look at this little exchange. It's so, so sad. It's MSB tragic. Ticks. Gets hit out of his he's eye frame. He's completely. And then he's the like, last hit, Purple comes out. Shards save him. 
Oh. And then he just goes to the right. And then Bagel rushes in, and MSB just up smashes him. I think he down beats. Yeah. So he down beats out of it and stuffs him in the last hit so that he can just confirm his advantage. Look at MSB! MSB shaking his fist like a madman on that one. <laughs> the Lord of Pop Offs. You can oh. mad scientist. And just like that, I believe we have our top four. <laughs> <laughs> Show it to us, MSB. Look at MSB. Oh my god. Yeah. No. <laughs> That's like a, a maniacal madman. Like, yeah, baby. Mad scientist. Uh, all according to plan. <laughs> He's got like a little evil laugh. Oh, old Cragman yells at Cloud. <laughs> oh, that was really good. All right. I believe that uh, you're all going to be graced by a very special someone soon named oh, Akashi. Yeah.